Welcome to my channel, I'm Zame from Ecstasy Tunes. In this video, I'm gonna give you a secret to create an awesome vocal chop in Cubase Pro 10.5. So are you guys ready? I have this awesome, beautiful vocal performance here. It's performed by one of my favorite singer-songwriter, Aisha. She has a very beautiful, soulful voice. You can listen to her all day. And I'm so glad uh, to work with her on her first and second album. And now we're working on the third album. Okay, I'm using her vocal sound to create a vocal effect. The kind of effects that you can hear from Output's Exhale VST. Okay, so let me show you how you can create that kind of uh, sound using Cubase sampler track. This is actually an ad libs used in her latest release oceans roll i will leave the link in the description below go and check it out the music is produced by me follow her on spotify and also on youtube she's amazing okay now let's listen to this audio file painted on your chest i'm gonna press alt and left click here to cut and i'm gonna drag this down to its own audio track and i'm gonna shift right click and bounce the track so i want to have a separate audio file i don't want to duplicate of the first file so once i bounce this i'm gonna double click on this audio file to open the sample editor go to vary audio click edit vary audio and now i'm gonna have these notes that she sang I'm gonna make sure that all these notes are in the same note okay so I'm gonna move this up to D sharp or E flat okay I'm gonna straighten the curve and quantize okay now let's listen okay it's a straight one note okay I'm gonna bounce this track one more time I'm gonna shift right click and select create sampler track okay now we have to tune this to the right note which is D sharp okay now I'm gonna enable audio warp and go to mode and change to solo let's change the form and filter okay this sounds good already Let me add some glide and see how it sounds. Okay, the key here is just to mess around with all these filters and envelopes to create the kind of sound that you hear in your mind. Or, you know, just want to replicate a sound that you hear from any VSCs like Exhale. Okay, I'm going to go to the pitch envelope and change the attack and release okay just play around with it until you get the sound that you want I'm gonna change this to one shot Okay, I'm gonna go to Amp Envelope and uh, shorten the release, change to one shot. And change the attack a little bit. If you want to create a tremolo effect, you can click on this monophonic button. Okay, let's turn up the volume a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna add some effect here. So let me go to... Let me search for reverb. 
Okay. Let's load up a preset. Okay, let's increase the time. Okay, because I want a longer wet reverb. See, I've just created an awesome vocal effect with sampler track in Cubase, the kind of sound that you can hear in Exhale and other vocal VST. Okay, of course, if you have money, you can buy the VST. That's a great VST. But if you don't have, and if you want to know the theory behind how to vocal chop, I just show you how you can do it. So you're welcome. Okay, now I'm gonna save this sound as a preset. So how do I do that? Go to preset management and select save preset. Okay, I've already created vocal effects folder. So when you open preset management, you won't get the attribute inspector window. So you have to go here and click to open up this window. Now you can select the category. You can go to vocal and the character mono glide. Mm, single processed mm, short and one shot okay and now I'm gonna rate this this is 10 but I can only rate until 5 so I'm gonna rate this 5 because I created this. It's awesome. Don't judge me. And now you go to style and select ambient chill out, subcategory vocal effects, sub style. I'm gonna go to ambient chill out and down tempo. Now let's name this preset vocal FX3. So I'm gonna hit OK and save this preset. Okay, now I'm going to go and open a new sampler track. Okay, now this is empty, right? Click preset management and load track preset. Now we can find the vocal effects that we just saved. Go to vocal, go to FX, ambient chill out, down tempo, mono. Now I can see the preset that you just saved. I'm going to double click on this now. If you notice, the reverb that we add is already saved together in this preset. Now you have this awesome vocal chop slash effects. Guys, that's my secret to awesome vocal chops. So if you find value in this video, please smash that like button, subscribe to my channel, turn on notification and share this video to all your friends and family and to everybody. All right. Thank you for watching, I'll see you in the next video.